For many residents of Albion, the grim reality of Friday's tornado disaster is just now beginning to sink in. Even so, most victims of the disaster are coping with a little help. We have more in this update from Action News reporter Matthew Locke. It's been nearly four days since a killer tornado ripped through Albion, causing death and mass destruction. Even so, some victims are just now beginning to feel the psychological impact of the disaster. Fortunately, help is close at hand. Well, we try to normalize their feelings, uh, first of all, because many people are saying, am I losing my mind one minute, I'm laughing one minute, I'm crying, I don't know what to feel, I don't know what to think, and uh, basically we're consoling them, uh, putting our arms around them, uh, uh, telling them um, that it is going to be okay. Uh, some of the children are having nightmares and uh, are concerned, is it coming back, and the parents are coming in concerned about them, and we're kind of uh, uh, talking with the parents as to how to console the children.